Hey everybody, in this video I'm going to show you guys how to recover deleted photos on iPhone and iOS devices. You're going to be able to recover all your deleted photos and videos even if they were permanently deleted or removed from your device. So even after the the 30 day uh, limit. So after 30 days, like all the photos are, uh, get permanently deleted in the, in the uh, recycle bin or whatever. But I'm going to show you guys how to still recover it with no computer. Uh, there is no computer needed for this tutorial and also there's no backups needed either. So don't worry guys, you'll be able to get everything back even stuff from like years ago. Um, and yeah, you'll be able to use it as long as it was like the same iPhone that you took it with and deleted it. If it's like the same iPhone, yes, this will work guys. But let me go ahead now and show you how to do this. It's so easy and it's gonna work for you guys guaranteed. And it takes only like, like 10 minutes to set up and no computer so anyone can do this. So let me go ahead and flip my camera and show you guys how to do it. Okay guys, so the way it's gonna be done is by getting this app right here called Photos Recovery. As you guys can see, I have it installed right now and it's like basically um, a tweaked app that gives you like Apple developer, uh, you know, access. Uh, and I found it, but like, look at this guys. It says you can now recover all deleted photos and videos, spy on others' messages and many more functions. So with it, not only do you get to recover your photos, but you actually get to spy on people's messages, which is really cool. But for this video, we're gonna be doing the recovering the photos. So let's go ahead and demonstrate that. I'm gonna click okay. And you're gonna see it says no photos or videos. Like if you, if you deleted everything, you have no photos or videos at all like me, you're gonna see this button pop up right here that says recover. And this is not normally available on any iPhone devices. This is only with this tweaked app, guys. Like I said, uh, photos recovery right there. And I'm just showcasing it to you and then I'll show you guys how to get it. But you click recover and it's gonna go ahead and recover all the deleted photos and videos that have been permanently deleted. And as you guys can see, it's a success. 1,573 photos have been found and 218 videos have been found and successfully recovered. Like, look at that, guys. This is literally insane. So, it found so many. We're going to click OK. And there you guys have it. All my photos are back. Yes, that is Blade. If any of you guys are drainers, let me know in the comments below. But that's pretty funny. You got Echo 2K there. Uh, anyways, guys, some fluffy friends. Anyways, guys, yeah. Like, it literally recovered every, any, everything on my phone. Um... And we we're able to get all of our photos back and videos, which is amazing. Uh, and normally you would have to spend a lot of money to even be able to get like some of your photos back. And usually that's like recent ones. This one, it goes back all the way in time and gets everything. So how exactly do we get this photos recovery app on iPhone? Well, it's quite simple guys. Before we can actually get it though, uh, you have to make sure that your device is compatible with the download. And to do this, uh, we just have to change some settings on our iPhone really quick. So. What you guys are gonna do is open up your settings on your iPhone and you're gonna to wanna to just change some settings around really quick. This is a very, very easy step, uh, but it's very important that you guys do it correctly and um, otherwise, you know, you might run into issues and it won't work. So, and the download won't work. So first thing that you guys are gonna to wanna to do is on your iPhone in the settings, open a battery and make sure you have low power mode off, just like that, okay guys? So super, super important, make sure you have low power mode off. And then once you guys have done that, we're gonna exit from there and now we're gonna go into general and then in general, you guys are gonna to wanna to scroll down a bit and then you're gonna see a background app refresh. And you're gonna to wanna to make sure you guys have this turned on to either Wi-Fi or Wi-Fi and sell your data. And then once you guys have done that, so yeah guys, make sure background app refresh is turned on to either Wi-Fi or Wi-Fi and sell your data. And then once you guys have done that, you're gonna exit from background app refresh and now go over to about and make sure your software version on your iPhone is above iOS 11. Otherwise, the download won't work. And then once you guys have done that, you're going to want to go down here to App Store. Or actually, not App Store. Go down here to Safari. Where is it? it should be here somewhere. Safari. And you're going to want to look for... Um, here it is. Block all cookies. Make sure that's off. And that's all you guys have to do. And now we're actually ready to get this Photos Recovery app. So how exactly do we get the photos recovery app guys this is the name of it photos recovery how exactly do we get it well it's actually quite simple all you guys have to do is go on right over here you see where it says that right there you guys are going to want to go there and just follow the instructions on there and you, it'll explain to you exactly how to go ahead and finish getting your app guys but just go on over there um and you'll be able to go ahead and get your photos recovery app very, very easily. It'll only take you like 10 minutes or so. But yeah, you can just go on over there and, and enjoy it, guys. So that's how you guys get the Photos Recovery app. Thanks for watching.